So we at our dive spot at the moment. On ascension on top of the hill, we're walking through the forest. 10 degrees apart! Send it! Hello, girl. Welcome to Sailing Lady Africa. I'm Ricky, and this is my wife Simone. After two years of hard work on our boat, she's finally ready to take us from South Africa across the Atlantic to the Bahamas. Be sure to join in our adventures by subscribing down below. With only a short amount of time permitted on the island, we wanted to see and do as much as we possibly can, so we're off to go for another dive at Comfortless Cove. On our way there, we had to ensure we didn't run over any wild donkeys that roam free on the island. We at our dive spot at the moment and uh, we've got our 15 buck rental so 15 pounds for the day unlimited mileage so that's a great deal obviously you know how much you can drive here it's only five miles across so they're not worried about putting too much miles on and here's what the dive spot looks like check it out we're gonna enter over there head out and check this area out here Yep, follow the white stones. Ricky was happy to be in clear turquoise water. Ricky had to come to my rescue as a shark popped up behind me from nowhere. Thanks to Emma for the warning sound. The dive was good and the water was amazing and warm. Are you going up to Green Mountain. We're going to check the rainforest out and we just came from a dive. Shit. This place is amazing. I'm really enjoying our time here. What do you think, Patty? How's I your time? I love it. Very nice. Land. Land. Green, not blue. Yeah. <laughs> Green, it's beautiful. Not blue. And the water was amazing too. It was very handsome. 27 very nice. degrees Celsius. It was amazing water. We headed up to Green Forest, the only man-made cloud forest in the world. Joseph Hook arrived on the island at the behest of Charles Darwin to plant the island with vegetation to attempt to increase rainfall as the island was barren. Green Mountain is now a national park where endemic species are actively conserved. Watering my flowers. Welcome, hun. Thank you. To love. your new house. It's nice. I like it. Do I have a nice view? You tell me. Oh shit. That's a good view. The island's pretty cool. We're chilling, enjoying it. It's nice and cool down here compared to, uh, co cool up here compared to down there. It was hot down there. And uh, now we're gonna go get some grub. Makaku! What you got there, Makaku? <laughs> Me and Glenn have been craving pisangs, <laughs> bananas, all the time. So I know Glenn went to figure this out.
20 loaves of banana mm -hmm. bread and give them to everybody you yeah. know. Which yeah. is yeah. Awesome. And that's kind of a, that's actually a smaller size hand. Yeah. Yeah. How many bananas do you need for banana bread? Banana Three. pie. Whoa. Six maybe? Banana cream pie. And if oh, I gave you 12, is it <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> military base at the moment. Up time, my stomach's bumping. What you catch? What you catch? <laughs> the fishing had been so amazing in Ascension, we caught some fish to barbecue slash fry on the beach, but we needed to get our blood flowing first, so we headed for a hike up Green Mountain, as there are numerous trails you can walk. So we're hiking Du Pont. So far, she's uphill. Juniper. In the Or in the The view from the top was absolutely amazing. So we are on, nearly on top of the hill right now. I'm Ricky, it's my last And this side looks like this. The northern side where we anchored at looks like this. On ascension on top of the hill, we're walking through the forest that on a volcanic island. It's freaking insane. It's so wet, so moisture, it's muddy, and it's freaking unreal. The island's pretty majestic. Yeah. Check it out, it's just bamboo. Crazy. <laughs> what the f? Don't tell f crocodile. Don't tell Betty. No, that's an alligator. I think he's dead. Oh Why my word. How do you know that? No, they, that's they, a nice bender. I think he's hibernating. And, and he just died there. To find out if he's plastic. I got quite a big piece of bamboo or if he's in my hand. Yeah, because his eye looks nothing. Like Should we see if he's dead? Huh? <laughs> 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 so much. We made it to Green Mountain Summit. 859 meters. Above board. sea level. Yo! I can't believe you didn't see anything. I was expecting it to be open up top. But it was pretty cool. I got to walk through a bamboo forest. Yeah. Never done that before. Uh. The two lovebirds matching outfits. Me, just uh, third wheeling here in the back. Giving um, the two people some alone time. You know. <laughs> Hi, Ma! Oh. Oh, sorry, babe. I think you're. I don't know why it's looking. Hello, what are you guys doing here? Hitchhiking. Have you got a permit? No. Well, then you've got a <laughs> off then, right? <laughs> but it takes three weeks to get a permit. Oh, all right, carry on. <laughs> carry on. Carry on. <laughs> The next day we headed off to see Fort Bedford. It was constructed in 1903 and used to defend the island. Ben, ready? Hold! 10 degrees apart! Send it! <laughs> you gotta make the sound effects, you're shooting. Fuck, inside this thing, you deaf after the first shot. <laughs> Babes! <laughs> Go 
motor is spinning. So give the front plate how thick it is. Ben, they must have had an ammunition system that brought the ammunition up on an elevator. They weren't carrying it up the stairs. It was bright time at the beach and we cooked up some amberjack and rock cod, aka grouper, while Emma, Phil and Ricky went for a free dive. Going by master. Rock card. Courtesy of uh, Ascension. He's called Rock, you know. <laughs> He's called <quite> Rock. <laughs> mm -hmm. After lunch, it was time for another scuba dive at Sudan. To not just swim or go, go diving today with them because um, the sharks just are a little bit too suspicious for my liking. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and click on the notification bell to let you every time we upload a new episode. And don't forget to like this video, it's a free way you can support our channel. Are we up early? Six bells. Sparrows caught, Ricky says. We're gonna go check out the turtles. Hello, girl. Had to do a diesel run as the fuel station was only open on Tuesdays and Thursdays for three hours. The landing is pretty gnarly.
When we started coming back to the boat early, I recommend you do that. If you do come to Ascension, you leave before sunset or during sunset to get back to your boat. The first two nights we left when it was night time and the, the amount of Galapagos shark that are in this pier and they are super aggressive and they're hungry. They attacked um, Victoria Americans that we met in Namibia. They attacked their prop and uh, it was pretty, pretty gnarly so we decided we're going to do day runs and uh, no longer night runs. Valentine's Day was upon us and it was time for a little party and get together with the crew. Our stay at Ascension was at an end so it was time for one last dive at One Hook Bay with Crazy Tony who made our stay extra enjoyable. We had one last floating barbecue on the barge with some awesome people we met that work on the island. And Glenn got a last minute hair trim. We enjoyed our last sunset on Ascension Island. Stay tuned till next week as we embark on our trip to Brazil. We got the sad news that they're closed for to assist us with provisioning. Don't forget to subscribe below if you haven't already and give this video a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to support our channel, you can do so by joining our Patreon family. The link is in the description below. Hi, I'm Ricky. This is my wife, Simone. And so this is on the Red Mountain. We just went up from the, um, um, from the uh, boat. And, uh, okay, so, hey, hey. Ciao, ciao.